I'm Samantha Stone. That's Triad Traffic. Yes, it is. And we are back live on WTQR with Miss Jewel. Is that okay to call you Miss Jewel? Baby King calls me that. Oh, boy. Hey, so yeah, okay, I'll call you Jewel then. I ain't getting close to BB King. Miss Jewel. <laughs> What's been an experience uh, with you, especially with Ty? You know, you guys have been dating for eight years? Almost ten. Ten. Dude, where is where does the it ring? Go? Where, where do you go after that? <laughs> if we have kids, we'll definitely get married. Yeah. I think until then, we, I don't know. We never yeah, really uh, felt the Never need. talked? Never talked about it? I mean, I, I, do you want to get married? If we have kids, we definitely want to. Okay, so yeah, you, nothing that, in that, we've never really, I don't know, never really cared. Really? Yeah. That's interesting. What's the best thing about that guy? What do you like? What turned you, tell us the first date about Ty. <laughs> what turned you on about this guy and to keep him around for 10 years? He's a stand-up guy in a world of flakes. Yeah. So what are you trying to say? John was a, John Wayne was an actor. He, when he went home, he was just an actor. You know, Ty really is. He does what he means and says what he does and right's he, right and wrong's wrong. And He's I a like true that. guy. He is. He's, he's very gen- authentic. Is he? Now, has he changed a lot since you guys have been dating? I mean, come on. Guy, guy, guys change. I mean, he hasn't gotten fat. We've seen him. He's just a typical bull rider. <laughs> I think it's. I think it comes with the frame. The bulls do something and knock something out of them so they don't get <laughs> fat. No body fat makes me ill. <laughs> I know. It's crazy, isn't it? Yeah. So what, what, what is, I mean, what happened on the first date to get you interested in him? You know, I met him at a rodeo in uh, Denver. I had a night off, and um, he is, he helped me get tickets. And uh, we ended up talking on the phone for nine months and finally had our first date. Nine months? Yeah, I was touring through Asia. And, and he was doing his thing, too. Europe. Okay. Yeah, and I, you know, I didn't think it was like, I didn't know. I mean, yeah. shoot, you don't know until you know. Yeah. And, uh, yeah, we talked on the phone for nine months and finally decided to have our first date, but the only time we had off was um, an all-guy camping trip that he was supposed to go on that no girl has ever been on in the history of this camping trip. So. Right. And, and he didn't know much about me. He knew I was raised in Alaska on a ranch, but I never really told him much about how rugged it was, where I, how I was raised, yeah. you know. Because, I mean, how I was raised, like, the more you brag about how good you can ride a horse, it usually means the worse you are. You know sure, what I mean? Sure. So I just didn't say much. And on this trip, they teased me the entire time. And they were like, this is a fire, and it's hot. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, oh. Oh, really? Wow. Really? Where do I go to the bathroom, guys? Yeah, yeah. I don't know what to do. <laughs> and I just let him... About a year later, I brought him to Alaska, and he saw how I was raised. He's like, yeah. remember our first date, how I teased you? I go, yeah. He goes, I was a jerk. I had no idea. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies, let that be a lesson to you. Absolutely. Pay off. Well, may I play the uh, new song from uh, Jewel? You? I would love it. Well, okay, it's called Stronger Woman. She's got a new album coming. When's the album yeah. coming out? June. June? Okay. But this so- is out the fifth, the single. You can get it. The fifth on iTunes. The fifth on yeah. iTunes. Very cool. Well, it's called Stronger Woman. It's on Valerie Music Company. Jewel, ladies and gentlemen, on 104.1 WTQR.